When I share an apology tonight, we're going to try something that I've never tried before. So this is a little experimental. But I want to ask uh, Congressman Mike Garcia to come up right now because See you, Mike. Good he has an apology. <laughs> so <laughs> Congressman Mike Garcia, come on up. Good evening, folks. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Well, I want to, uh, first of all, uh, thank the rabbi for this uh, a tremendous opportunity. It's, a, it's an honor and a blessing uh, to be here with you all this evening. Uh, this is actually uh, the second uh, public apology. It was, this was uh, brought up and addressed at my town hall that we hosted just a few weeks ago at College of the Canyons, where I was very clear uh, that I regret what I said. It was a foolish comment. Um, I'm, a, I'm a patriot. I love this country. I've served this, co this country in, in combat operations. I've served in the Middle East. I've, uh, as the rabbi said, I've been a staunch supporter not only of uh, the Jewish communities here in the United States, but also of our very important strategic allies in Israel. Uh, and so I don't take this uh, history lightly, uh, and I don't take the, the experiences of the Holocaust and obviously what the, what the Third Reich uh, has, has done, not only uh, to our history, but the globe's history, lightly. Uh, and so I am sorry. I, I, I do atone for uh, the comment. Uh, I take uh, great pride in, in, in how careful I am with my words, how precise I am. Uh, as, as, a, as an elected official, I realize that the words do matter, uh, the style does matter, and we've got to be more responsible with our words. And I, uh, in my history, I've never made a comment like this. I never will, obviously. Again, I think the rabbi's statement of we only talk about Nazis when we're talking about Nazis is perfect. Uh, and I think uh, Frankly, everyone needs to, to be better at that. Um, I love this country, and I, it, 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 and, and I remind uh, all Americans uh, in, in our district, but around the country, that this country was founded on Judeo-Christian beliefs, the, the principles of our religious beliefs and, and, a, and, a, and a love of God under God are, are truly the underpinning of our foundational documents, the Constitution, the Declaration of Independence. Uh, when our founding fathers were writing to each other, uh, and then ultimately writing the documents that fed into the Constitution and into the Declaration of Independence, the Book of Deuteronomy is the, is the most prevalent reference that they make. And so they are men of God. Our founding fathers were. I think we need more elected officials uh, to double down on a commitment to God. And, and I know here, especially here tonight, uh, as, we, as we celebrate Yom Kippur and, and the Blessed New Year from last, uh, the last couple of days, uh, I know you are all committed to that, and I, and I want you to know that I am too, and I, and I regret my comments. Uh, I deeply am apologetic for those comments. If you go to the, the video from my town hall, I, I go into more detail. Uh, but I love this country, and I, and I, and I just uh, I got emotional in the heat of the moment uh, w when I started seeing our government behave and uh, our government protect itself rather than protecting Americans. Uh, it was a reaction. It was a visceral reaction. Uh, but the, the metaphor and the hyperbole was inexcusable. So uh, with that, uh, I appreciate you guys letting me come here tonight uh, as we enter the high holidays. Uh, know that I'm, I, I am with you. Uh, I, I value uh, our Jewish communities uh, here in our district, around the country, and, and around the globe. And uh, I do deeply regret the, the parallels that I made to uh, the Third Reich. It's, it's inexcusable. Uh, and for that, I'm sorry. I atone for that. Uh, as a Christian, uh, I want you to know that I... I, I go through this process as you all do as well, and, uh, uh, and I'm very grateful for the opportunity to be able to come and personally explain this to you all and for uh, the rabbi's support in this, uh, in this journey of mine. Uh, we're all human, uh, and we all make mistakes. Uh, we are uh, uh, obviously frail human beings, as you all know, and uh, uh, well, I'm certainly not an exception to that, and I, and I do, am gratefully uh, 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 appreciative of the opportunity to come explain this to you all. Thank you, guys. Appreciate you. Thank, Thank you, you, Rabbi. Thank you. Appreciate you. Thank you.